I've spoken uh, about uh, the process of the committees in the assembly and the so-called kill list where Republican bills are automatically killed in committee by a relative handful of, uh, uh, of members of the assembly without any real discussion and certainly without a floor debate or floor vote. Well, I'm in the Government Operations Committee. We had a kill list a mile long. Seven or eight of my bills were on there. There were great bills in there uh, from other members of the assembly. There was a term limits bill. There was a bill uh, by Assemblyman Johns called the Soul Act, Single Opportunity for Legislative Equality, which would every two years allow one lawmaker to bring a bill up for a floor vote. Uh, that was killed. Think about that. You represent 130,000 people. What we're saying is let's let each member get a bill, one bill, every two years to the floor for a floor vote, uh, and let's vote it up or down. If it gets voted down, so be it. Term limits. One of my term limits bills was killed. A couple of other term limits bills were killed. There's an eight-year term limits bill. There's a 10-year, 12-year. Take your pick. There's options there. 82% of New Yorkers want term limits. And we call ourselves the People's House, but seven or eight members of the Government Operations Committees just killed our opportunity for term limits in this state. It's wrong. Uh, the process has to be changed. It's, it's undemocratic. Uh, let, let's really truly be the people's house and uh, let every lawmaker get bills to the floor and especially bills that have overwhelming support. We can't get New Yorkers to agree on 80 percent on anything. But on term limits, we are in agreement. So let's get an up or down vote. Let's let everybody see where they stand on this important issue.